what up guys, it's your boy Jono and I've got a new squad builder for you today uh, my last one got I think around 500 views and thank you so much to everyone who watched it and commented on it and liked it honestly never expected to get any, any anything near that like ever so uh, big thanks to everyone so <coughs> it's uh, quite a bit hybrid it's, it hasn't got such great chemistry which I'm not so bothered about um, but yeah starting in goal we have Courtois the team of the season uh, team of the uh, Spanish team, whatever you want to call him. Uh, I got rid of him. I sold him off and bought his standard one because, for me, in game they're basically the same. Although his stats might be better, he's not great. So I just changed him up and I bought. Um, I changed my strikers because you'll see that I just sort of went for the pace abuse from the strikers. Um, so I sold the team with one and I got. <coughs> I sold Courtois and I got uh, the inform Steven Sessegnon. So this is the defense here I have. Uh, PSG Sacco, Alex is Vatan Hagen, and Udinese Benitez, who is Moroccan. Uh, this team was based around the Adel Tarat and Belhanda. Um, the pace, uh, in the lack of pace in my defence really hurts me in a three back, and a lot of goals I, I get hit on the counter almost every game. And although I'm not letting in a lot of game, uh, goals a game, I'm scoring a lot, so it's not too terrible. Uh, that's the Balhanda who I wasn't so impressed with uh, in the end. Maybe I'm going to have to dig deep and buy the team of the season really to see him. But this team of the season, El Ahamadi, um, was the shock player of the team. He has performed so well and I was so impressed with him. Then my left midfield is Mbap Sufa who I have now changed to El Asaidi. El Asaidi? Asaidi? He's, um, he plays for Essi Hervinen I think and he's Moroccan. Uh, he's just got a bit more pace <coughs> and he's just a slightly better player even though his rating is not as great and if you watch my last squad builder you'll see that I went with Valbuena again rather than at right wing I went with him at right mid and yeah you know what I think about him then we have right wing is uh, Hatem Ben Arfa who whatever it's Ben Arfa there's not much to say he's got good ball control, good dribble, good shot then Tarap who uh, is uh, my favourite player in this team Ball control, dribbling, speed, shot, even his heading, he's <coughs> um, a world class player and I, I honestly mean that, I, I love him to bits. Then up front we have Romelu Lukaka who, um, who as much as everyone says he's insane, I'm not such a fan. I, I, yeah, he's got a good left foot and he does power his way through. Um, but he's not great. Uh, a lot of games because of the three back I've uh, been hit on the counter, so often switch up at half time to a four one two one two and put Lukaku on the right striker side and a Bonglahor on the left so they can both cut in with their finesses and they're both and a Bonglahor comes into these games and he's um he's great. He he is, he he changes up the games for me. Anyway, I'm gonna leave in the description a link to a series that I'm thinking about running so you can sort of call that one the pilot episode uh, it's just one episode and I'd like to know what you think about it you know watch it all don't watch it all watch five seconds of it just leave me a comment or a like so I just sort of know what people think and uh, whether I should uh, bother carrying on or if I'm wasting my time if you think I'm wasting my time then you know I'll try something else out try try bring out a different thing that people are going to like um, but yeah, the, so far it's nowhere near the squad builder, the views on it, but that's why, you know, I didn't really expect that. Now this goal here from Neymar, I, I don't understand how Courtois is even getting that. His back's almost to the goal when he's finessing that in. So uh, this is what I'm talking about here. I was 3-0 down by the 24th minute. So I changed it up to a 4-1, 2-1, and brought a Bon Lahore. And yeah, these aren't great goals from Gabby Bon Lahore. Um, but these are this is just showing what what he does, what he change, what he brings into the game. When you bring him on as a sub, and I actually went on to win this game six four. You can see at half time it was three two, and straight from the center we go off and we get a pretty cracking goal. I mean that's a great one from run from Lukaku. We just turn it around to Tarap who uh, gets it nice and down into the corner. So. <coughs> yeah, these uh, so pretty much like I'm liking this team. The rating of the team isn't that high, so you get paired against people that have, you know, decent gold t teams, but don't really have that many informs and stuff. Uh, and I think they sort of see this team come up with like five or six informs, and they're like, oh crap! Like, is this really happening to me? Cause, and and if you want wins, I beg you go out and get this team because you'll get paired against people that aren't so great, and it's worth it. 
anyway this video is coming to a close so uh yeah leave a like uh comment maybe see what you tell me what you like to see in this team or something and maybe even subscribe uh this is the last goal from hatem ben alpha so thank you very much for watching <laughs> see you next time